Good day everyone! I am your professor Abdul Hakim Aquino Abdullah, your cutest professor ever. So in today's video, we will be discussing a very important matter in teaching and learning process. In this 21st century, we are very focused in utilizing digital technologies with our students as a tool to support learning. We find it more easier and can simply attract the attention of the students for the reason that they are very exposed to what we call technological advancements. But we have forgotten that we still have this traditional teaching and learning process that can be a great source of knowledge or that can be a great activity for the students to learn more knowledge about a certain subject. And one of this process, or one of this method, is what we call the diorama. According to Lindy Hatton, diorama or 3D boxes are a part of elementary and secondary school in almost every subject matter. They are an excellent way to merge craft projects and the understanding of the subject. A diorama is a three-dimensional scene created to illustrate an academic subject, a plot of a story, or an event in a history. A teaching environment with effective teaching tools like diorama plays an important role in achieving the successful outcomes since using diorama can stimulate students, help them to become active participants, provide opportunities for individually suitable examples and real-life experiences, as well as high academic achievement and an ability for critical thinking, problem-solving, and creative thinking. This is very important because it enriches the educational experience of the learners and provide more meaningful learnings for the subject. So to sum it all, we shall always remember that Diorama is a three-dimensional scene created to illustrate an academic subject, a plot of a story, or an event in history. Diorama can be used in all educational levels. They pinpoint a moment of learning and high level of understanding. Dioramas can also be used in real-world setting as problem solvers. And overall, I we should see diorama as a fun and creative way of learning and teaching process. So thank you for watching this video. See you next day.